day 16. Heal your inner child. Connect back to the young, confident, happy and free version of yourself. Now, get yourself into a nice, comfortable position. Preferably with your legs crossed, spine up straight, allowing you to relax. And just stare in your eyes an object or a corner or a place in the room if you're doing this outside just find something you can fixate your eyes onto now as you fixate your eyes all I want you to do is begin to drown out the rest of the world, focusing intently, focusing solely on that one place. The more you focus, the more relaxed you begin to feel, which will allow you to heal. To clear any subconscious negativity. Taking a deep breath in, completely focused as you breathe out. The more you focus, the heavier your eyes begin to feel. And as your eyes begin to feel so incredibly heavy they may just want to blink now that's right blink now and you may feel with every blink your mind your find begins to slow down as it slows down you begin to relax as you begin to relax that's right it slows down even more and if your eyes aren't already closed take a deep breath in Breathe out and completely close them down. Relax yourself and go even deeper. All I want you to do is just imagine that you've got glue on your eyelids. Sticking them down, locking them down tighter and tighter and tighter together now. There's no need to strain your eyes. Just imagine what it would be like if you had the world's strongest glue attached to your eyes, attached to each eyelid. Imagining like it's completely dried and they are locked together now. And now that your eyes are completely and fully locked together, you can even try and open them. Noticing the more you try and open them, the more they just want to lock down and close down. Notice how hard it is if you try and open them. And how much easier it is just to let them close and stay closed. How much more relaxed you feel with your eyes closed. Just allow your body and mind to completely relax as I count down from 10. You may in front of you imagine a 10 step hypnotic staircase. Every single number I count down from 10, not only will you relax, but you will completely let go even deeper into hypnosis now. 
starting with 10 as your mind slows down you'll begin to find yourself relaxing deeper down to 9 and 8 as your mind relaxes you let go down to 7 and 6 can you find even deeper ways to relax down to 5 and 4 how relaxed are you as you step down deeper to 3 What does it feel like to be completely relaxed? Two. When I reach the next number, all I want you to do is enhance that level of trance and relax to the deepest levels of hypnosis. Taking a deep breath in. Breathe out and one completely. Relaxed. Now. As you begin, to allow yourself to completely and fully relax now can you allow your mind to open up to new possibilities to magical to mystical experiences in order to help you heal your inner child Bringing back that feeling of love, freedom, and carelessness. Before we heal your inner child now, can you think back to a time when you just had complete freedom? You were carefree, happy, confident. Maybe doing something you love, maybe something you're good at, painting, drawing, or even just running around in circles. I want you to remind yourself and leave an impression on yourself to say, this is who you will choose to be. This is who you are bringing back out again because your inner child is always within you I'm not putting anything within you I'm just allowing you to open your mind to allow out the inner child that's within because when you allow that inner child to come out to be free you will be able to heal grow and feel just like a child again being carefree and happy all I want you to do is just imagine walking down a pathway in a forest Can you hear the birds tweeting, the leaves rustling, seeing all the vibrant colours as a leaf falls from the tree and hits you gently on your head. Just pick up that leaf from your head. and feel it, inspect it, look at it. Can you feel the little grooves in the back of this leaf? What does it feel like? What does it smell of? And I want you to notice, whenever you see leaves, you'll begin to realize that freedom that's already within you, that inner child coming out to serve you. Whenever you see any type of leaf, as you look to the trees on a walk, driving your car, 
you will remind yourself that you can heal your inner child now and be completely free, happy and care free now. Whenever you see those leaves, every time, it will appear in your mind. You don't have to be conscious of it because it's now a program that will just happen naturally whenever you see a leaf. And if I ask you what happens when you see a leaf, or leaves, or trees, you know exactly what will happen now. As you're walking down this path, this path to healing, first you must do some feeling. And in the distance, you can see a little cabin and just allow yourself to walk towards it. As you walk towards this cabin, you can hear the crunch of the leaves beneath your feet, the warmth of the sun on your skin. As you get to the door, and before you enter, just take a deep breath in, breathing out and letting go, completely clearing your whole mind so that you can find this place to heal. Grab the handle of the door, open it up, and just notice there's a little TV. On this TV is a past experience where you felt pain as a child. The first experience you can think of. Whatever comes to mind is the right experience. And I want you to just watch this happening on the TV from a third person perspective. As you watch this, you begin to feel the emotions that you felt. Maybe it was a painful negative experience that happened that made you quote unquote grow up very fast. Maybe it was something someone said to you. Maybe a bully or maybe a so-called friend. What is going on in this place that causes you so much pain? How does this version of yourself feel? At that time you may feel like a victim, which is totally understandable. But I want you to ask yourself this question. If you stay in this victim mentality for the rest of your life, will it make you happy, carefree, living the life of your dreams or will it pull you down I just want you to ask yourself why did you feel this way Should you feel this way? Why shouldn't you feel this way? And most importantly, what lesson can you take from this experience? There's no right or wrong answer, but if we search for a lesson, we can find an answer. 
and ask yourself this question. Will this answer serve you? Will it help you be happy, carefree, forgiving, and loving, self-loving? And all I want you to do now is just imagine yourself being dragged into the TV, into this experience, in a quiet space with your younger self, looking yourself in the eyes and just seeing that complete innocence, the complete love and beauty you have for this incredible young child. How amazing they truly are. Look your younger version of yourself in the eyes. And just say these words. I love you. I will forever be here for you. I've always got your back. It is safe for you to come out now. And just hug that younger version of yourself, feeling all that love, compassion, and energy you have for your younger self. For as long as you need. And when you feel as if you've done enough, open your eyes in no rush. And when you open your eyes, you'll begin to feel that urge of self-love for you once again, what you truly deserve. When you open your eyes, you'll feel the best you've ever felt. Taking as long as you need, and I'll see you tomorrow.